Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I'm Gregory Gage and this is just like a little bit of a weekend away in South End in Essex. <laughs> I've not been here since I was about 10 years old and they've got an adventure playground thing, Peter Pan's Adventure Land. It's not anymore. They've changed the name, it's not Peter Pan anymore. I wonder if that's anything to do with Disney. Um, they have the world's longest pier. Ooh, this is very bright. This is a bit too bright. It's not. There we go. There we go. There we go. They have the world's longest pier. It's over a mile long, but we have just checked into the Premier Inn and we've booked ourselves or you can eat breakfast tomorrow and Saturday. So yeah, we are in South End this weekend for Craig's dad's wedding. I'm not gonna be like vlogging that because you know, it's, it's, it's not my wedding. But yeah, this should be fun. And um, yeah, how much was the train down? Uh, with a truck without one to buy travel cards, nine pounds. Probably I imagine if you didn't have that, about 12 pounds or something. Okay. Cool. Craig and I both have weekly, monthly travel cards, zone one to five in London. So from zone five to South End, it was yeah just over nine pounds to get here. So not that bad. Hmm. Single ticket, not return. <laughs> but yeah, I'm gonna show you guys around the room. There is a bed, which is definitely needed in, in hotels. There's a gorgeous view of the car park outside. Da -da. But we are very close to the beach. So if our window was on that side, we would we'd see the sea. Do, 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 do. There is a mirror just here, which lights up like so. I'm severely underdressed, by the way. It, <laughs> I got off the train and it was freezing. It was so, so cold. And I'm there in my shorts and my t-shirt and my thing. Absolutely freaking freezing. So yeah, this is pretty much the room. And I'll take you into the bathroom. This is actually quite a nice bathroom. It's not bad, not bad. Um, how much was this? 238 pounds. 200 pounds for the room, that's about 8 pounds to go the breakfast. Oh, okay, not bad. 200 quid for 100 pounds a night, hmm. not bad. Pretty good. Right, we've had a quick little rest. Bruce. Craig has spruced himself up quite nicely. Mmm, mmm, mmm. And apparently there's two gay clubs here. Yeah. What are the gay clubs? One's called Colours, which is a very famous Essex club. Mm -hmm. And then you've got the Hill or something, or the Castle, so it's a pub. I mean, like. So it's a pub, not a club. But it's, a, it's all lit up with like the rainbow lights outside. Cute. We are just gonna head out, so we're gonna be walking along the, the seafront. Beaten by the wind, you realise that, don't you? I mean, it'll be windy. We're in a windswept air. Mm. You got the keys? Yeah. Good. Ready? Let's go. Ready? Ready? Okay. Here we go. There's the sea. That's the pier. It goes all the way That's down. That's a really, really long pier. It looks there's, there's no one on it. Do you think it's closed? What did I? Know? Craig is trying to figure out what that land is over there. That's Kent. I said to him, oh that's Ireland. Yeah, you know, would you say that's Wales? So I said, that's Wales. And I said, that's France. Was that? no, what? no, the first thing I said was, oh that's France over there. And you believed me. You like you were, you were telling the joke you thought it was real. No we didn't. France is a lot further away than that. Right, so that's pretty much the end of our drinks. Drink. I said I would be back. I said I would be back after our little catch-up. I catch said up. I'll be back after our drinks. Oh, I haven't had that many drinks. 
<laughs> Rosalyn Beach Hotel. Rosalyn Beach Hotel, that's where we've just been. Really, really nice hotel. That's where the wedding is tomorrow, so very, very pretty. We've had some, some food, club sandwich, and fries, and we are now just walking back to our hotel. But we are walking along the seafront. We don't need to cross over just yet. Look how nice it is with the moon like on the water. Listening on the water. It's pretty. I really like it. I'm very, very glad we got out of out of London and into Wessex. Right, we are back in the room and we are just gonna watch Celebrity MasterChef. It's currently got Joey Essex on TV. <laughs> I'm a big fan of Joey Essex. He is thick as sh <laughs> but it's funny and he's hot. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. It's been a quite a nice night's sleep, actually. The bed's really comfy. Oh, it's really good. We're just getting ready to go down for breakfast now. Breakfast is from 7 till 11. And then the wedding isn't until 1.30 today, so. Are you ready for food? Good, good. You're always ready for food. Breakfast. Bubble and squeak, hash browns, tomatoes, baked beans, corn sausages, and toast. Craig had like a full English. Mm. Breakfast is done, and we're now just having a little walk on the beach. You can hear that, it's a stony beach. You can hear all the crunch of the stones and there's the there's the sea well there's the sea that's going into the river thames oh this is nice da, 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 da. i want to go down there to the adventure playground right we are done we are ready to go are you ready to go i'm ready to go All we've right. made a mess of the bedroom we always do when we're staying in hotels no, this is just, this, this is the worst it's been no, for. No, it hasn't. Yes. Whenever we say one day in a hotel, we always manage to make it the worst. Well. Right, come on, let's go. All right, I'm coming. We will catch you in a bit. We spent pretty much all morning watching The Dark Crystal, Age of Resistance on Netflix. Um, it was a good way to spend the morning. So good. I know, it keeps making me want to cry. I love Deet. Deet is my favorite and so is What's his name? I can't, I don't, the one Brilliant. that just wants to be a, 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 po, a, a hop. 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 The podling. Hop. And he wants to be a par, par, paladin. A paladin. Prove the strength of your spoon. It's so cute. Very cute. We are here at the wedding. I'm here with Kate. 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 She's come all the way from New Zealand. And my brother-in-law over there. All right. What are you doing, Craig? you got there? They got lemon. What have you got? I got cherry vodka. Oh, that's nice. <laughs> Try it. Honestly, it's really good. Just a little tiny bit. Oh, that's lovely. I don't normally do straight vodka. That is honestly, it's like a cherry drink. But this is Grey Goose. Grey Goose. Cherry flavour. It's good. I mean, try it. It's a really good vodka and it's flavoured. Drink. Just a little, just a little sip. A little tipple. Oh, come off it. That is too much. We have eaten food, the song has just stopped, so I've got like a very brief amount of time to speak to you guys before like the monetization kind of ruins it. Um, Craig is already hungry and he wants more food. Monetized. I'll have to cut this short. Just made it back to the room. We're gonna spend the rest of the night chilling and watching The Dark Crystal on Netflix. That's pretty much our Saturday evening sorted. Tomorrow we're going to get up, go and explore a little bit of South End, including the pier. I will catch you guys tomorrow. Okie dokie, we have finished tidying the bedroom. 
and it's much, much better. We've packed, we're ready to go. We're gonna try and leave our suitcase at the reception desk here so that we can go to the Adventureland place and check out the pier and everything. So, are you ready, Craig? Yeah. Good. Yeah. Trying to figure out how we can go home. It's about 8 o'clock. 8 p.m. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> ah, do, 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 do. The sea is on the other side of there. There's the Sea Life Center just there. The Sea Life Center. That's probably because you were about that big. There we go. Beach. Got a little mini golf area there. So you can play mini golf. There is a train going along the pier right now. I'm gonna zoom in and hopefully you can see. Yep, there we go. There is the train. Oh, there's a little nature reserve bit of information. You can see all the different birds that you can spot. Look at the big ships. The ships are huge. The Disney Dream that yeah. go past here might do. It doesn't go this way, it goes out there. See it, but it doesn't, I think it doesn't go past it. Huh. This is like I've stepped back in time because there is a wimpy. <laughs> they have an actual open wimpy. Can we go? Maybe. We've got loads of arcades along, along this stretch. Loads of them. I think I've spotted it. There's an aerial thing in one of those machines, the crane machines. I can definitely see an aerial. Either that or just like redhead something. That's definitely not all in the cricket. Oh my god. Oh my god, it goes all the way around. Oh, yeah, I don't know. I don't know how I'd feel about that. Oh, that would be awful. I would hate it. <laughs> I would hate it so much. Even the noise of it. I would, you just, uh, I mean, I would do it. I'd probably give it a go. No, I, I, no. <laughs> well, this is the world's longest pleasure pier. Yes, I want to do that. Uh, no, not with that sound. Oh, yes. I'm not doing any of that. Yes. <laughs> right, so, we are... I want to go on it. It looks cool. I'm not going on it by myself. Why? Because you've got to go on it with me. No. We're now just walking on the pier. It's, what was it? Four pound for both of us to walk both ways. Mm -hmm. Very, very cheap. You can get a train, but... Train costs like four pounds each. Yeah, so... And it's a nice walk. It's a beautiful day. Oh, look. I'm actually too hot to be wearing my coat. Look how long this walk is. Over a mile long. It's the longest pier in the world. And there's a museum at the end of it, apparently. So, yeah, I would call this beautiful. It's very quiet. It's really quiet. I love that. I love the, seeing the sunlight on the mm -hmm. on the water. I love the ships in the distance, and you can see the, the fans. The, what they call Wind them? turbines yeah. over there. Yeah. The train is just coming along behind us now. It's there. Oh, this is exciting and creaky. I like the vibrations. It's sweet. So if you wanted to get on that train, it was four pounds a I think you could buy four pounds a go. It's it's cheap both ways. It would be really nice to come down here when it's stormy. It would be bitterly cold. I think, I think it would be closed anyway. That's Kent, right? Yeah. Yes, that's Kent too. It's the Dartford Bridge that's somewhere. The, like, you go that way and that's the Thames, isn't it? Yeah, that way is London. That way is... France. I have these little rest spots down here. They make me think of, like, Victorian times for some reason. Because yeah, of the... Yeah, all the rapes. Yeah, well, with just reminds these. Of <laughs> it's very sweet. We're at the one mile point, we have walked a mile from shore, and we still have a while to go. So we've just stumbled on this. This is Jamie and Jimmy's. This is where they film at Friday Night Feast. We've just 
stopped off at the end of the pier for some rocky road. This is really, really sweet. It's like we're very far out. We are. More than a mile out. It's a very curious little bird. And this is really sweet. It's cool, but everyone's name's like carved into the wood. We're up on the sun deck right now. Oh, the golden one up there. How do they even get them up there? That high? So we are waving goodbye to the end of the pier and making the long journey back to dry land over there somewhere. Here we go, we are going into Adventure Island. Are you excited, Craig? All the nostalgic vibes. Oh my god, I got the little fun house. Oh no, it's not. Do you want to go into the ghost house? Yes, yes, yes. And they've still got a little Peter Pan just up there as a little reference nod to its former glory. Really want to go on this, but Craig doesn't want to go on it. Someone else told me that I should go on the time machine. That's the time machine. I don't think I'd want to go on. That would just make me feel sick. It's cute inside. They've got a whole little indoor play area for the kids. Little arcade games and things. If you wanted to do like loads of the rides here, you can get wristbands. To, uh, like 25 pounds for unlimited rides, or 32 pounds for unlimited. Uh, there's different rides that have different things. Or if you wanted to just do a couple of rides, you can get like tickets that'll let you go on some of the rides just with like tickets, which I think are £1.20 a ticket, but some rides are like two tickets, so it'll be 2 40 which isn't bad. It's cute. I think Craig is very, very fragile from, from the alcohol last night. So he's refusing to do any rides with me. It's cute to look at everything though. Look, we found Disney stuff. Kind of cute though, the Dumbo's cute. This is literally like stepping back in time. Oh my God. Zoltar. Yes. I don't have a pound, otherwise I would do it. It's from like big, isn't it? Huh? Big. Me? When he wants, he wants to be big. It's got um, Tom Hanks in it, the movie. He speaks to Zoltar and he says, something and then all, he wakes up and he's a grown man. They're doing a musical. The nearest thing we had to anything like this was the Trocadero in Leicester Square, but that's long closed down. That was the UK's, was it Europe's? It was Europe's only indoor theme park because it had a ride in it that was literally like from the top to the bottom of the building. Oh, I love Toothless. <gasps> he's cute. Not too long ago, we were right over there at the end of that pier. All right, we're on the lookout for some donuts. Craig wants some donuts by the sea. Here we go, we have our donuts, our little donuts by the sea. I got a bag of candy floss as well. So, yes, they are gonna be really hot. They're fresh. Oh, they look good. And these donuts are very, very tasty. I got the cinnamon ones. Mm. How are yours? Very sugary. Tasty. Just heading towards the sea life adventure. Craig is obsessed with sausage jocks, so <laughs> it's very cute. <laughs> we are heading straight into there. Well, into there. 
Not so Oh, look how flat he is. I know. Oh, I want one as a pet. I want one as a pet. Do you know what? I love the tails. I know. They're, They're just so off. Cute. That's my Patronus. It is your Patronus. I love so that. So we've also. found ourselves in, where are we? Sea life. The sea life adventure. Oh, he's looking at me. Oh. Hello. Oh, look at his little paws. They are so cute. They've got like webbed feet, haven't they? Yep. Sea life aquarium. Oh my god, it smells awful. <laughs> it smells horrible. They look like the ones that we just saw out there in the wild. They yeah, probably are. <laughs> they could be. Little fish. It feels quite strange that it's open though. No, they're like, not, they're not like, obviously you're not supposed to put your hands in there or anything. They're not like, oh, I like these. Oh, those. Oh, those. Oh, those. Great. How many hearts does an octopus have? Oh, right. An octopus has three hearts. I bet he's popular on Valentine's Day. How long can an African lungfish live out of water? I mean, I... <laughs> uh, That's why they say like there's, we've got we plastic in our no, bodies now do. because of all of the the plastic that's in the ocean and the oh, yeah it's terrible. Did you know that ray egg cases, also known as mermaid's purses, they can take between nine to twelve months to hatch? It's these things here, the mermaid purses. I can see Ariel with that. There's this one in there. Yeah. There's lots up here. Poison dart frogs. Oh, he's teeny tiny. But yeah, they are poisonous, obviously. Hence the name. That is a huge tortoise. I bet it's, um, I bet. There's That's loads like... of meerkats everywhere. Look, he's digging underneath the tortoise. That's older than you and me combined. Oh yeah, probably. They'll live a lot longer than we will. Yeah, they do. Love this little lookout one. I know. Mm -hmm. oh, well, that's pretty much it from Sea Life Adventure, where we are right now. We're gonna make our way back to the hotel, get our, our suitcase that we left behind, and then get ourselves home. We've got our suitcase. We're waving goodbye to the Premier Inn, which is right behind us there. Yeah, we're gonna walk back to the station now, because it's about a half hour walk and it's 20 minutes until the bus comes anyway. If you like this video, give it a big thumbs up and I will see you in my next one. Uh, give me tips on places to go in, London, in the UK for little staycations. I'll appreciate it. See you next time. Bye. Mwah. Okay, so we're just heading home now and it's been a really good weekend. One thing I probably wouldn't do again though is the sea life <laughs> adventure thing. But it was quite sad seeing seeing like the monkeys in such a small a small space. And in Disney World where they put loads of space in um, Animal Kingdom and everything. It just didn't seem like there was enough space for the animals there. So aside from that, I'm in the quiet zone on the train so I'll leave it here. But yes, bye guys.